Uh, first off, this is what I'm working with. I got the katana, the blood katana. Uh, normal pistol and a little torch that I'm never going to use. Uh, I basically put on the best arcane defense I had, which is, you know, basically, you know, black church hat, black church garb, gas coins, gloves, I guess, and uh, hunter's trousers because those are, at least what I have, the highest arcane defense. So uh, let's do this. Now uh, I killed the guy up there uh, for the first time ever. I didn't realize he gave you something, but if you kill him you get the eye rune, which gives you more items from fallen enemies. That's always useful. You know, if you want to get those uh, you know, cold bloods and blood vials, silver bullets, shit like that. Uh, now when you first get in here, he is not going to attack you the first time you fight him. He's just completely dot by. He's just a big old pussy cat. You know. Uh, so before he attacks, let's just take a look at him. As you can see, his head is basically a rock. So don't attack there. It's not a weak spot at all. It's basically saying, hey, attack this, but uh, it doesn't take very much damage. So you just want to go over his body. The back part of his body is good. Alright, let's uh, do it. Now, uh, the way I have my character set up is uh, like a tank. So, a lot of damage. A lot of health. So, uh, the easiest way to do this is, frankly, to kill all the spiders first. It sounds like stupid, but it really is. You know, they do a shit ton of damage. But it doesn't take much to kill them at all. So it's just kinda... They're just like him though, you know, don't attack the face. If you attack the front, you sit there forever whacking at his face. So you just gotta warm them out, attack the butt. Now, considering how strong I have my character at this point, I could just run in and destroy Rom very easily. I mean, I'm not even using that strongest weapon. You gotta watch out for that. But I'm trying to give you a. Uh, basically display all of his past, what happens when you, you know, kill the spiders, how he's going to react to different stages, what you can do when you do that. So as you see, you know, this is still stage one, he has no more minions, and he's not going to fall any until I attack him, and bring him down to stage two. As you can see, I do 71 damage to his face. That is not much. Where if I go around to his body, 280. Now if you can still attack him, he does that, and if you do enough damage, it'll stagger him to where he doesn't do that. You can teleport. Alright, looks like he might have entered stage two. Yep. See that coming. Uh, what you want to do is when he stands up, run diagonally. too far away. But uh what you want to do, like I was trying to say, is run diagonal and see if we can't cover it. And maybe do a little zigzagging in between to make sure that you avoid all the uh giant. But uh, you know, once again just kill all the little spiders. You don't have to run sideways, you just gotta, you know, move to the side. Oh, there's one of his other moves. Basically with that, uh, you just get away from him, that's one of his up close attacks. It's always a good idea to keep him within view, always. Now, it's actually a really busy move to avoid. I just got done killing him in the Chalice Dungeon, and it's a much smaller area. Now the cool thing is when he does that and he, one of his little spider minions he caught it, they flip. So, you know, that's something that we I 
I keep fucking it up. But basically, as soon as he stands up, you wanna just run to side or dog roll. <laughs> God, I just had so much trouble avoiding that stupid ass move. That's literally the best way to do it, I find, because you with that, you know, lock on for me, you're doing it, so you can stay at a medium close range. That didn't do it again. way to avoid it, truthfully. You know, as you see now, I'm not taking hits as to where I was before. Actually, the other move is kind of like a uh, push away by saying gravity. I'm not going to explain any facts or anything. because they're extremely overpowered. supposed to do but uh that's basically it you know it's not hard watch for his movements uh i'm looking for the lady i'm supposed to walk up to i don't see oh wait there she is but uh you know just 
take your time, get rid of the little ones, attack him, watch out for his uh, range attack, that's the one that does the most damage, you know. But yeah, it's pretty easy. God, the loading screen takes forever for my system. There it is. You still seek out something broken. Seek out the nice new bone. I really want to kill that thing. I, I'm not sure if you can though. I know there's one in the Chalice Dungeons, and there's uh one that she actually teleports to you can kill. Mombus? No, that's not it. I can't pronounce her name. But, uh, you know, fairly simple. Just gotta take your time, kill the little ones, attack the big one. And that's, uh, pretty much it. So, yeah! Good for you who do this. And follow, like, subscribe. Talk to me. Leave some messages, you know? Alright. Have a good one.